this is Mickey Moody and uh, I'm here today recording some tutorial downloads, one of which is um, a song I co-wrote with David Coverdale and Bernie Marsden called Foo For Your Loving. People have asked me before about certain chord changes and certain inversions, certain physical aspects about um, some of the riffs and chord changes, soloing, etc. Things which I take for granted, but um, I suppose there's a, a definitive way of playing it, and unless you get close up on someone's fingers um, in the nicest possible way, then you don't really get to play the stuff exactly as it was written and played, and it never quite sounds the same. In the video, I'm playing all the guitar parts or pretty much all the guitar parts um, that I showed with, with Bernie Marsden in, in the original White Snake, uh, to the best of my ability. So um, you'll have not, not just the lead guitar tracks, you'll also have the rhythm second guitar tracks as well and any kind of harmonies that uh, we played together. During the solos, um, I specifically improvised because I don't think any of us rock or blues rock players play the same solo twice anyway. So they're pretty close to what you might consider the originals. Uh, they might just be in a different order, kind of the Eric Morecambe way of doing things in some ways. But that's, that's the way we play. And I think it might encourage you to improvise yourself and, and not worry so much about playing note for note. In the video, we, um, we've actually given you um, a tone and gear section where you can see what kind of equipment I was using from the guitars to the amplifiers and if we have any pedals, um, which pedals I was using to, um, picks, um, techniques, etc, etc. So hopefully you get some idea of um, where the sound came from and how it was created. Also included here are backing tracks uh, without the lead guitar, so you can be me or anybody, anybody you choose to be on those tracks. Uh, and also on the backing tracks we had uh, one of my favourite drummers, Jimmy Copley, uh, on drums, obviously, and uh, on bass we had Erica Cafu, and what a fine job they did. So when you play along with the backing tracks, you're on your own, and just remember that I'll be backing you. I'll be your rhythm guitarist for that. What we hope to achieve in the video is um, to give you a good idea of how to play these White Snake tracks so that you can play, for, play them for your own pleasure at home. You can go out and play them with your band, especially if you have two guitar players, because you have both parts. And if you get offered the job of Whitesnake, then you know what to do. <laughs>